Pie dough has a reputation of being somewhat difficult to work with, so let me show you a recipe that's actually fun and easy to handle. My recipe calls for a one-to-one -one ratio of flour to butter by weight, but it's a tried and true pastry formula that improves the flexibility of the dough. Cut the butter into half-inch cubes and toss with the flour, and squish each cube flat. That's it. Once it's incorporated, knead until the dough forms a lumpy ball. Plop the dough onto a well-floured surface and sprinkle more flour on top. Seriously, have at it. Use as much flour as you need to feel 100% confident as you roll. Roll the dough into a roughly 10 inch by 15 inch rectangle. Fold the 10 inch sides together, then close the newly formed packet like a book. Fold in half once more, bringing the short sides together to create a thick block. Divide in half with a sharp knife or bench scraper. This dough is about 68 degrees, which is the ideal temperature for rolling a pie crust. And from time to time, you're just gonna sprinkle it with more flour and then flip it over, and that'll show you any patchy spots that might be prone to sticking later on. So we're gonna continue rolling until it's about 13 inches across. And because the dough is still so cool, it's gonna be easy to pick up. It's just a really sturdy, easy to handle, you can hold it with one hand. Drape across a nine inch pie plate. Use a pair of scissors to trim the dough. You wanna have about one and a quarter inches hanging all the way around. Fold the excess dough over itself to create a thick border that sits atop the rim of the pie plate. 